Sometimes when working with JavaScript, you may need to check an array of data to see if a condition is met on only a single item. For example, maybe you have a checklist component and you want to ensure that the user has selected at least one item. And what you'd want to do is check that at least one of these properties of is checked is true within the array. And to do this, we can use a method called sum. This method will loop through our array here and it's going to execute a function and either return true if one of the elements pass a test or false if all the elements do not. So what we can do is create a new variable here to store our response in, and then we can set this equal to our checklist item array and execute the sum method. And this method accepts a function, and what we'll do here is pass it an arrow function, and then we'll give it a param of item for each item within the array. And what we're going to check is that each item in the array has a isCheck property that is true. And if we run this file within the terminal, the value is going to be false since none of the items pass the test. If we change one of these values to true, then it's going to be true since one of the items now pass our test.